Welcome to BCSD News. Here's a look at what's happening in the Bakersfield City School District. In an effort to keep our learning community better informed, the Bakersfield City School District developed an official COVID-19 dashboard detailing the number of positive COVID-19 cases by school site and work location each week. The BCSD COVID-19 dashboard is updated every Friday afternoon and includes positive cases from the previous Friday through Thursday. To access the dashboard, go to bcsd.com and click on COVID-19 dashboard. With that, let's get started. <laughs> Unit right. one. Our family and community engagement team is gearing up for the return of Loving Solutions. Loving Solutions is one of our parenting programs that we offer here from our FACE department. It's a parent behavior training program, um, and it is a class that guides parents in identifying concrete solutions and how to raise their kids um, ages five to 10 years old. Uh, it guides parents and how to support um, their children to have a successful and healthy growth through cooperative learning. Loving Solutions is a series of virtual workshops and classes meant to help parents with the challenges of raising children, such as rule setting, developing a healthy schedule and bedtime routine, supporting children with homework, and encouraging children to complete their chores. This program benefits the parents but it also benefits the students indirectly through the parents and, and the changes that the parents apply um, in their household uh, with the, the behavior tips that we give them from the curriculum. Loving Solutions is a 10-week program and follows an activity-based parenting book. Parents join together in a support group to learn and grow and help their children succeed in the classroom and at home. To sign up for Loving Solutions, Contact the FACE team or your school site FACE liaison. You will learn how to dream big, set goals, and take action. Thorner Elementary is inspiring students to dream big, focusing on setting and achieving goals. Goal yelled the fans at the soccer game. Touchdown signaled the ref at the football game. Mrs. Yabiku shared how goal setting helps you get ahead in life by staying focused and being persistent. My challenge for you this week is to create a goal or two for this school year. Really think about what you want to accomplish. Write the goal down in your journal. Next, think about how you're going to achieve that goal. Way to go Thunderbolts. We know you can do it. This is a very important song. We want to give a shout out to Melanie Monhe, a Chipman Junior High student who wrote and composed a short song for her classmates to encourage them to rise up and charge. Her song was showcased in the Chipman morning announcements and we were amazed by her talent. And that's where we leave you this week. Be safe and well. We'll see you next week. Not to find that society that will rise up in our true life. Charges will rise up in our identity. Yeah, we'll rise up. Awesome, Melanie. Thank you. Chipman Charger, she says rise up, rise up, and charge forward. Take care and have a blessed weekend.